Pepe Coin's next move will be critical. And in this video, we are going to dive into why that is. As we're taking a look at the chart, we're going to analyze this a little bit, talk a little bit about some of the news in this video as well. It's jam-packed with content. Appreciate you guys, as always, for stopping back by the channel. I am up and at it, drinking some coffee and uh, following this crazy, crazy crypto market. Now, here's the thing with Pepe. We did dip all the way down uh, yesterday, this is the hourly chart, okay? So if we zoom in here, we dipped all the way down at one point, guys, to about the 16 or 15 level. We are back at the 20 level now, okay? That is the 502 level. Right now, the RSI is showing us that we are trading sideways and we are getting ready for the next move. Are we going to get a breakout or are we going to get a breakdown? Now, similarly, back here on Saturday, we had a little trend up, and then we trended sideways before we had a hard dip. But this hard dip came at the heels of the entire market coming down. This looks very similar to this pattern here that we saw happen, play out, uh, happen to play out on Saturday. A little bit of an uptrend, followed by a downswing. Is this something that's going to happen again with the price of Pepe, or... Is this signal that we saw, this possible retracement up, going to create some momentum, some upwards momentum like we saw back in here on the Binance listing? Now, we, we may not have that blow off top and get all the way back up to the four or five level. However, can we get back up to, let's say, maybe the three level at one point or even the mid twos and start to consolidate and find some sideways action here? This next big move for Pepe is going to be very, very critical. Now, from the technical side of things, we already said the RSI is basically flat. Look at the technicals. Basically, the summary is neutral, meaning it's time for the bears or the bulls to take control. Moving averages show us uh, at a buy signal right now. Oscillators show us as a sell signal. That means we meet in the middle right now, and that's exactly where we are. Now, taking a look at the Twitter page, growing exponentially, by the way. Like, There's your word of the day, growing exponentially. Uh, so if we scroll on down, big news came out yesterday. Wazer, uh, Wazer X, India, uh, India is one of the uh, India's largest exchanges. They have listed Pepe. You can now buy, sell, and trade there in the INR market of Wazer X. So that was some big news that came out yesterday. Uh, and... Uh, Binance Convert adds Floki and Pepe as well. Of course, they're both listed now, Floki and Pepe, in the innovation zone. So that is also something to note. And uh, other than that, it's just a ton of funny, great memes. Oh, yeah, back on May 6th, just a few days ago, Bybit listed Pepe as well. So if you're looking to trade Pepe on Bybit, I've got a link down below. If that's something that interests you. Now, Pepe, when we take a look at the volume, it's spiked back up a little bit here in the last 24 hours, which is good to see. There you go. Now you can see it. Back up over a billion dollars here of volume in the last 24 hours. A lot of that has been some upswing from the start to the day yesterday. In terms of market cap, sitting at about $807 million. We'll see if we can climb back over that $1 billion mark. Pepe currently ranked number 57 on the big board. But again, Today's going to be a big day, in my opinion, here for Pepe and where we go. Because, yes, we are starting to trend up here over the past, you know, over uh, the past, I would say, you know, 12 to 15 hours here since hitting a bottom point yesterday. And we spiked all the way down uh, yesterday to about the 15, mid 15 range. Since then, nice little retracement up. We'll see if this can continue. And again, the bears and bulls are fighting right now to take control. Let me know what you guys think about this down below. If you got some value out of this content, make sure you guys hit the like button, push us up in the old YouTube algorithm, and subscribe to the channel. We'll see you in the next video. Take care.